In this video for the giveaway by Leo Kim Video, I'll just be having a quick tour of all the different wind up or play rail Tommy items that I own. So we'll start with the contenders in the left hand corner. Now as you can see, I don't just have engines from the capsule but also from the packets which I recently found in shops but I'll save that for another video. So as you can see I've got diesel 10 here, we've also got Dodge from the series 3 of the play rails, I've got three of the tanker wagons, a coal hopper from one of the Japanese series, I've got two of the cattle wagons or stock cars. As we, if we continue along the track, there's Toby, along with an undecorated Clarabel or Annie, I can't quite remember which. Then we've got a decorated Clarabel and Annie with Thomas from the not capsules from the, yeah, I'm not sure how you say it, package on the shelves collection, in the same as Diesel 10 like this. Then I've got James from the play rail with some of his express carriages. There's Stanley from Series 4, there's Hector from the Jap not from the Japanese series, but from the Australian Series 4. And then if we move over here, we've got Emily from the Japanese series. I've got Edward from the Package series. Then we have the Sad Percy from Series 4 of the um, Play Rails. And as you can see, there's a various assortment of buildings. As you can see, these sheds. There's this aquarium, which I've talked about in previous reviews. We've got the overpass, the little um, trees, Sir Topham Hat. And if we come down here, you can see all the extras that I've got. So I've got these extra buildings. I've got a second Hector. There's this chocolate car, which is from the Japanese series. Two more Fat Controllers. An interesting one, this one. There's a Skarloey from the package series, but despite that, he still doesn't have any of the... Pistons. There's Thomas from Series 1. So as you can see, he's got that face that I think is actually kind of weird. Then I've got another undecorated Annie of Clarabel. I've got the Tired Annie from Series 4. I've got one of the two, actually, sorry, of the original stock cars that we saw. Hang on. There we go. That we saw in Series 1 of the Play Rail series. Two of the open flat wagons. One of the troublesome trucks, there's another footbridge. Another turntable, oh god, please introduce points sometime soon. And another one is express wagons. Now, not all the tracks out at the moment, but you can see there's still some more in here. What's interesting are these. And these are actually bridge risers, which are designed to work with the special tracks, if I can find them. Nope, here we go. That actually have a little bit of a slant on them. And they're designed to work with a special bridge piece, which unfortunately I never got to collect. So these bits are kind of useless, but if you can make a makeshift bridge, very interesting finds indeed. And so now you're probably asking what's just my favourite character. Well, if I had to choose a couple, one of them would be certainly be Sir Topham Hat. I'm really impressed with the detailing on this figure, and it's really cute in size and scale. The only thing it's lacking is facial expressions, but he's got a nose and ears, so it kind of makes up for it. Um, so that's my third favourite character. My second favourite character would have to be 10 out of 10 for Devious Deeds. Not only does he have that classic angry kind of face and a really cool um, design, he's got the claw that goes up and down and actually opens as well, which is really unusual these days for most Diesel 10 merchandise, which doesn't actually allow you to open the claw and move it. it usually allows one or the other. But my most favourite piece would have to be our favourite steam tram, Toby. I just think the proportions on Toby, they're just all right. He's just like a great representation of what he looks like in a TV show. There's so much detailing. We've got all the windows, we've got the lights on the back, the buffers, the stickers, even the roof. We've got the bell, despite this funny little thing, which is meant to be the ropes for the bell. We've got whatever that thing is, I don't even know. He's got his chimney and his face, although not 100% correct, it's 95 and that's good enough for me. And so I really think my favorite of the ones I've collected so far would have to be Toby. And so thank you Leo Kim Video for watching this video and good luck trying to judge all the entries. Bye for now from Trains Extreme.